Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. As mentioned earlier, a database is really the entire collection of tables, queries, forms, reports, macros, and modules. In Access, you can only work with one database file at a time, and every time you open a database file in Access, its contents will appear within its own navigation pane. Now, each type of database object is represented within the navigation pane. However, the view that is displayed by default within the navigation pane may not allow you to view all of the objects easily. To be able to show the objects within the database, click the drop-down arrow that appears in the small title bar at the top of the navigation pane, and then choose the Object Type command. You can then click the same drop-down arrow again. Notice that this time you'll see the various types of database objects that you can show in a listing at the bottom of the drop-down menu. There is also an All Access Objects choice shown at the bottom of the drop-down menu. Ensure that this command is selected in order to display all objects in your database, grouped by category, in collapsible and expandable groupings within the navigation pane. If you do not have any objects in your database yet, then this panel will show no groupings until you've created the objects of the various types. Now once you have objects created within your database, you can then click on the name of the object category shown in the navigation pane to display the names of the objects that you've created. You can right click on any object shown in the navigation pane and then select either the open or Design View command in the pop-up menu that appears to open the selected object in its own tabbed window using the view that you specified. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.